fifth and final day of the game. Sri Lanka in a strong position after they bowl out England for 370 on the fourth day. They already have 121 runs lead in the first innings. So, it was a very little chance for them in losing because of that both openers walk to the middle in positive manner on this beautiful morning. Ballard is the bowler. He's bowling to Peter Mooney, the man who made 190 in the first innings, and five runs have already been taken from the first over from Agnew. That's not the plenty of gaps on the leg side. Another beautiful shot. Feet in the right position, clipped away. And the first boundary then ends. What a good shot it was, Tom. 15 on the board. He's picked up an awful lot of runs down there. Square of the wicket on the offside. It's been a favourite spot to him off the bowling of both of them. And beautifully caught. So both of them strikes. Vetti Mooney goes. And a very useful delivery there from both of them. Caught Betty Mooney trying to push it on the onside, bowled him two or three in swingers, that one cut away. And the first man's out with 19 on the board. And yet another milestone there for Ian Botham with the departure of Betty Mooney. That deep. Oh, my bold. Beauty. It's Botham's morning so far. A bit of irregularity there about the run-up. It finished up another excellent delivery. And Madagali goes bowled by both of them. And that's a little bit unlucky as a bow. It was another no ball. Caught the outside edge and it's four more going on his analysis. Dasher indeed. It would be quite nice to be able to look at that again because it's going to be very close. Again, so very nicely through mid on. It's going to beat them both for four runs. Ellison again. Again, it's good on drive. Other side of mid on this time. No, no chance of stopping that. Shot. Wait it for it, chopped it away down to a third man boundary for four runs. There's four more. Good shot, four runs. Beautiful stroke from Amal Silva. And there's no way the man at Deep Finley can cut that off. He only had some 30 yards to run. Close and closer than that even. Both of them has got him. A great 
right shot. Very severe on uh, anything that's pitched up, Silva. And he goes now to his half century. Got a lot of landmarks for the individual players in this. Yes, gone. Wonder Tunga's not uh, too delighted about it. Still not delighted about it. It's no third man now. There it is, the fielder. Anders. Not out. Yes, he's out. A long, long delay there before the umpire's finger finally went up. Heartbreaking minute there for Pat Poker. He thought he was going to give him not out. But the outside edge is uh, Aravinda Dis drive over the top of mid-off good shot well the captain said nice firm stroke by Mendes he has shoulder trouble and in fact was off the field for a time yesterday good shot Super shot, it's a no ball. It's a cracking shot. Great blow. A very, very powerful striker of the ball. And Silva still playing his shots. And that little bit of extra pace in the last yard or two just does it once again for him. And it's four more. Ellison again. one he wanted single to delete Mendes brings him yet another 50 excellent effort full of good strokes stating him on his 65 balls and he's given these uh, spectators something to remember him by he swung that away isn't that a fearful crash through mid wicket for four and uh, Richard Ellis One, it's gone up to Fowler again and it's just cleared him just a touch over the top of the head but it's six runs that's exactly the manner in which he fell in the first innings but just got that extra little bit of beef behind it this time and seems we've got a runner coming out now that's, uh, obviously looks as though it is crap And for a big hike again, and he's made it. That's a good hit. Six runs. It's a bold, brave shot at this stage. Takes him into the 90s. And he could easily push his way to 100 now without very much trouble at all. Against uh, the off spinners of Ian Botham. But he's carrying on playing his shots and really giving us some fine entertainment. But he's chipped that one up in the air. And Botham strikes again. Well, well, well. Port Fowler, bowl Botham, 94. Mark. No 
of the wicket for Botham. Richard Ellison is the man out at long off. Botham's off spin strikes again. Now, Silver has striked Fowler. And that's his hundred, his runner. De Silva goes through. They take two runs. Amal Silva, the wicketkeeper, goes to 101. Ratnaika is three, it's 289. Sri Lanka batted throughout the day and managed to score 294 for 7 in 80 overs. First innings hero Sidath went early today for 13 runs and then Ranjun, again failed to go for double figures. At that moment Sri Lanka were 2 for 27. Then Dios walks in and built 84 runs for the third wicket with Amal Silva. After Dios departs Sri Lanka had some trouble by losing two Sri Lankan youngsters in quick succession. When skipper Duliep's walks in Sri Lanka were 5 for 118. Skipper Duliep managed to maintain his form. He went to his aggressive style from first ball onwards. With 9 boundaries and 3 massive success he reached to 94, runs and fall off to Botham American Samoa his 5th wicket. He and Amal built 138 for the 6th wicket. Ashantha went for quick 14. Star of the innings, Sri Lankan wicket-keeping opening batsman Amal Silva scores third Sri Lankan hundred of the match. He batted entire day, that is 320 minutes faces 255 balls and scores 102 with 12 fours. Botham took six wickets, last two wickets he balled spin to take them. During the match he overtake Gibbs and climb as the all-time third highest wicket taker. Finally match ended with a draw. This is the second test played between these two teams, records as of now is one win to England and one draw. Due to his marathon effort of 190, obviously Sidath Wedamuni was nominated as the man of the match. Well, the main event is over, but series still going on with warm down games. We'll see how the series ended along with final presentation interviews in our last episode next.